Anti-tank guided missiles were designed to destroy tank. So which is the deadliest anti-tank missile in the world today? Here is the list of some of the best man portable anti-tank guided missiles that are currently available. Number 10. Milan ER. The Milan ER is a new development of the combat-proven Milan anti-tank guided missile. That is in service in service for nearly 50 years and was adopted by more than 40 countries. This weapon uses a new launcher and more powerful missile with longer range. Development of this weapon began in 2005. The missile was ready for mass production in 2011. The Milan ER has been selected by at least three existing operators of the Milan system. The Milan ER uses a new firing post with integral thermal imager. The new launcher is compatible with previous variants of the Milan missiles, including Milan 2 and Milan 3, and remains a wire-guided system. However judging by modern standards such guidance method is considered outdated. The new missile has a tandem-shaped charge warhead. It penetrates 1000 mm of steel armor behind explosive reactive armor. Such penetration is sufficient to destroy even the most heavily armored main battle tanks. This missile is capable of penetrating more than 2 meter of reinforced concrete. Hence it can be also used against troops in buildings, bunkers, and field fortifications. Number 9. TOW-2. The TOW-2 is a heavy anti-tank missile. It is used by the US Army since 1983 and proved to be a very effective weapon. The TOW 2 remains a very capable anti tank system despite the fact that this weapon is nearly 40 years old. In the basic infantry form, the TOW launcher is mounted on a portable tripod. The TOW 2 system is serviced by a crew of three soldiers, including commander, gunner, and assistance gunner. The launcher can be disassembled and transported by the crew. The TOW 2 missile is available in several versions and is produced in wireless and wire guided forms. The wireless missiles require no special alterations to the launcher. The TOW 2 launcher is compatible with all previous TOW missiles. This weapon has got a thermal imaging site and can be used at night. Number 8. Cornet M. The Cornet M is a Russian anti tank guided missile. It was first introduced in 1994. Western reporting name of this weapon is at 14 or Spriggan. Its fearsome reputation is derived from its extreme range that's far beyond most current anti-tank missiles. The Javelin, for example, can only deliver its lethal top attack warhead 2.5 kilometers away while the original Cornetti developed by the Instrument Design Bureau had a maximum range of 5.5 kilometers. With a 152 mm diameter it is one of the largest and most powerful anti-tank guided missiles ever built. This feature is meant to defeat the threat posed by explosive reactive armor on modern tanks. It penetrates 1000 mm of steel armor behind explosive reactive armor. However despite significantly longer range the Russian Cornet is not that advanced in terms of guidance as other modern anti-tank guided missiles. Number 7. Shershin. The Shershin is the Belarusian variant of the Ukrainian Skiff anti-tank guided missile. It is manufactured in Belarus by a state-owned company. While both systems appear interchangeable the Ukrainian Skiff and the Belarusian Shershin have slightly different applications. This weapon uses laser guidance. Its RK-2S missile has a tandem-shaped charge warhead. It penetrates 800 mm of steel armor behind explosive reactive armor. Such penetration is more than enough for disabling current generation main battle tanks. Maximum range of fire is up to 5.5 kilometers. Should the operator prefer the 152 mm P-2B missile for the Shershin the effective range stretches to an impressive 7,500 meters. With a frightening penetration of 1,100 mm against rolled homogeneous steel behind explosive reactive armor. During the night time the range is reduced to around 3 kilometers. Number 6. Mapats. The Mapats is a man portable anti-tank guided missile system designed for use by infantry, vehicles, and helicopters. The name is short for man portable anti-tank system, and Mapats is also Hebrew automatopia for an explosion. 
Known operators of the Mapats include Israel, Chile, Ecuador, Estonia, and Venezuela. Little of the origins of the Mapats have been published. This weapon is clearly a derivative of the US-made BGM-71 tow missile, but no assistance from the US military or defense industry in the development of the Mapats has ever been mentioned. It was first unveiled to the public in 1984, and apparently entered service with the Israel Defense Forces in 1985. Though it is easily confused with a BGM-71 tow at first glance, the Mapats has a different guidance. It is a laser-guided missile. The original warhead was capable of penetrating 800 mm of steel armor, which was adequate to defeat any tank in service in the mid-1980s. Capable of defeating 1,200 mm of steel armor after explosive reactive armor enough penetration to defeat almost any tank in service today. Number 5. HJ-12. The HJ-12 is a Chinese copy of the US Javelin. It was first publicly revealed in 2014. This Chinese missile has similar specifications and capabilities as the baseline FGM-148A Javelin. It is being proposed for export customers as a less expensive alternative to the Javelin. It has a range of 2,500 meter and penetrates 800 mm of steel armor behind explosive reactive armor. This missile uses a similar infrared imaging guidance method as the Javelin, and attacks its targets from the top. Actually there are more Chinese advanced anti-tank guided missiles, similar to the US Javelin that are being offered for export. These include GAM-100 and TS-01 anti-tank guided missiles. Though these are broadly similar to the HJ-12. Number 4. FGM-148 Javelin. The FGM-148 Javelin is a US-made man portable fire and forget anti-tank missile. It was fielded in the mid-1990s to replace the M47 Dragon. Deliveries to the US Army and US Marine Corps commenced in 1996. Currently the Javelin is one of the most advanced and portable anti-tank guide missile system in the world. It can destroy any current main battle tank. It can also target low-flying helicopters. Only some existing anti-tank missiles, such as Israeli Spike can compare with the Javelin. The Javelin is a man portable fire and forget type weapon. It is shoulder fired but can also be installed on the tripod or tracked and wheeled armor vehicles. The Javelin missile system is operated by a crew of two. The missile has an infrared imaging guidance system. It locks on the target before launch. During flight it guides automatically. Maximum firing range of the Javelin is 2500 meter. Recently the manufacturer developed a version of the Javelin with a range of 4,750 meter. Number 3. Spike LR2. The Spike LR2 is a recent fifth-generation anti-tank guided missile. It was developed in Israel. The new LR2 has even longer range and increased armor penetration. It was designed for use by the infantry and light combat vehicles. This missile can be also used by helicopters and watercraft. In 2017 this missile was first ordered by the Israel Defense Forces. This missile has a range of up to 5.5 kilometers. When fired from helicopter this missile has a range up to 10 kilometers using a wireless data link. The Spike LR2 uses infrared imaging guidance. It has a new infrared seeker with a smart target tracker and artificial intelligence features. It has a tandem-shaped charge warhead and penetrates 900 mm of steel armor behind explosive reactive armor. This missile is also available with a multipurpose blast warhead which is effective against buildings, bunkers, and field fortifications. It can breach up to 200 mm of reinforced concrete and detonate within the structure. This multipurpose warhead is also effective against lightly armored vehicles. Number 2. Amtas. The Amtas, also known as the Misrako, is the first man portable medium range anti armor missile developed in Turkey. Development of this missile began in 2010. Although its exact origins are unknown, on paper it qualifies as a fourth generation anti tank guided missile endowed with range, precision, and lethality. Its appearance, however, seems to have been influenced by missiles like the US TOW 2B and the Israeli Spike MR. 
The Omtas was designed to knock out main battle tanks with explosive reactive armor. It can travel a distance of 4,000 meters and penetrates around 1,000 millimeters of steel armor behind explosive reactive armor. This missile has infrared guidance. It can be launched in fire and forget mode, as well as in fire and update mode. Also it has direct and top attack modes. Number 1. MMP. The MMP is a recent French 5th generation anti-tank guided missile. It was developed to meet requirement of the French army and was first introduced in 2012. Deliveries to the French army commenced in 2017. The MMP is a multi-purpose missile. It can defeat anything from tanks to bunkers and hostile troops in buildings. This missile has a range of 4 kilometers. The MMP offers non-line-of-sight launch for both extreme ranges and obscured targets. It has a tandem-shaped charge warhead and penetrates 1,000 mm of steel armor behind explosive reactive armor. It is a top attack system with fire and forget capability. However the operator can also guide the missile to its target manually. This anti-tank missile is suited for indoor launches. The MMP follows a convenient setup consisting of a launch tube, a portable fire control system and guidance unit with day and night optics, and a collapsible tripod mount.